Hi everyone, it's Matt. And in this video, I wanna show you how to record your Microsoft Teams meetings and save it as a video to share with everybody else. So it's really easy to get a meeting started up from the conversations section of any channel in any team. You have this little meet now button at the bottom of the thread. It'll ask you for a title of the meeting and then you hit meet now and then off you go. To start the recording, you come to the ellipsis button here and choose start recording. And you'll see now at the top of the window, we've got a recording button and tells everybody who's recording. You also see this banner across the top saying that the meeting is being recorded and everybody sees this to make them aware that they're being recorded. And you've got a link to the privacy policy here as well. So you can dismiss that. So once the meeting's finished and everybody's hung up, when you go back to the conversations window in Teams, you're gonna see the entry for the meeting. So you can see it started, that was by a click of the meet now button down here. And within the meeting started thread, it says the recording has stopped and now it's saving the recording to Microsoft Stream. Eventually, when the video has been processed and uploaded to Microsoft Stream, you're gonna see this little icon pop up here where you can actually run the meeting video in line in Teams. So it opens up a video pane, connects to Teams and runs the video straight in line. And you can see the views and the likes up here as well. And you've got some functionality on the video player itself. You can change the volume obviously. You can change the settings. So the playback speed and quality and you can make it full size as well. So there's other things we can do with the video. We can make it a tab within our channel. When we do that, we get a new tab along the top here and it puts the video in the tab so everybody can read it. It's a good way of drawing attention to the recording. If I go back to conversations, we can also get a link. So this is gonna get a link to the video that I can share via email or any other means I, I need to. And the final option we have here is to open a Microsoft Stream. So as we said, these videos, when they're recorded and processed, they're automatically added to Microsoft Stream for you. So you don't have to manage it or download the video or do anything with it. If we choose to open with Microsoft Stream here, it's gonna pop up the browser. And it's gonna take us into Microsoft Stream and show us the video. So here you can see the video player. And beneath that, you've got some metadata about the video. So who published it and when. You can see how many views it's had how many likes it's had. If you wanna share it from here, there's more options to share the video. So for example, we can share from a certain point. So we can set start at and then choose a time. And then we can copy the video link and we can share it on social media as well. Then we can also get an email link so we can share it with people in our organization or we can embed it. So we get the embed code for our webpage. The last thing I want to call out here is the notification. So automatically, when you record a meeting, you get an email notification telling you that it's been uploaded. So you see this email, your Teams meeting has been recorded and is uploaded to stream. You can see a link to the video and some information about privacy. So that's how you record your Microsoft Teams meeting.